Well, still with the, the power issue, and the city of Cape Town is spending hundreds of millions of rands stockpiling diesel for the coming winter months. Mayor Jordan Hill Lewis says the possibility of ESCOM plunging the country into stage eight is very real. Electricity consumption traditionally does spike in winter, and the city of Cape Town wants to shield its residents and businesses from any crippling blackouts. That's the plan revealed by the Cape Town mayor, as ENCA reporter Aisha Ismail found out. Mayor Jordan Hill Lewis says Cape Town is not leaving anything to chance. He says they've put plans in place to deal with blackouts up to stage eight. Should that moment arrive, the city's disaster management centre in Goodwood will spring into action, with all essential services coordinated from there. This will ensure that emergency services continue functioning and routes remain open. So we are very, very close to, uh, to a stage eight event, and I'm very worried for April, May, June in particular, those are the, the months when the, the grid is under most winter pressure. And we are making plans here in Cape Town to do what we can. Uh, if that does come to pass, it will be an extremely difficult uh, period for South Africa. We will do our very best here to mitigate it as best we can. And what, what does that very best entail? It entails hundreds of millions of rands worth of diesel and extra generators, which we have bought. We've expanded our, our capacity to store diesel, We've spent 25 million rand on, on more storage facilities. Uh, so we, have, we are filling up our diesel tanks twice a week now. And, uh, previously, we used to only fill them up once a month. We're now doing it twice a week to make sure that they're always full. Kill Lewis says the city is keeping one of its units at Stienbras Dam in reserve for extra capacity. Should stage eight become a reality, South Africans will be without power for up to 14 hours a day. Aisha Ismail, Cape Town.